we came off a hard-fought game last night. Our guys just weren't um, weren't who we needed to be against Tennessee. Give them a lot of credit. They're a very physical team. Um, they had their way with us around the basket, and that was to me that was the story of the game. You know, we we could not uh, rebound with Tennessee today. And when you give up 16 offensive rebounds in a game, when you're trying to chip away at the, the lead and you can't you can't make it. You can't make it a one and done situation on the defensive end. You, get, you give you no, you give yourself no chance to, to catch back up. And the only time that we were, uh, the only time we're going to be effective is if we can be a team that gets stops, rebounds the ball. We couldn't do that. You know, Stokes and Naaman give those guys a lot of credit. We knew those. We knew coming in uh, that they're as physical as any two in the country, but knowing and being able to execute are two different things. Well, whether it did or whether it didn't, we still didn't get the job done. So, I mean, it's, I mean, to me, it's, it, it doesn't really matter, you know. So, um, nobody cares about the labor, just showing the baby. Well, twofold. Number one, I'm sure Stokes is a, uh, is a, is a kid that, had a chip on his shoulder. <laughs> he probably remembers the last time he played us. Um, and so I'm sure he was a little bit more determined, uh, a little bit more hungry to, to, to go at us. And give him credit, did a great job. We didn't, uh, we allowed him to get too deep of post position. We didn't crowd him when he caught it in the post. And when Tennessee missed a shot, we got bullied. He just pushed us anywhere he wanted legally, got the rebound, and, and uh, he was the better man. Um, you know, we talked about it. You know, we're human, and, w and we knew that, um, you know, we fought tooth and nail, and we, we came up short. But, you know, we also talked about leaving here 2-1, and one, you know, winning two games against two major conference teams. But, you know, talk's cheap. We've got to be able to execute it on the floor, and we didn't do that today. Well, their guards are long. You know they uh, they do a really good job of denying not everybody not not just Samaje but everyone on the floor, and so that that you know, chops up your offense a little bit. We had to do a better job of being able to dribble, penetrate, and get inside the defense. And we stayed on the perimeter too much. And when you do that, uh, their length can bother you. But you know whether it was Samaje or D or Brandon, you know we all had a tough time of of getting our guards in the lane to make other players better. You know, it is really tough, and it's one of those where, you know, you, you respect those two guys that started, Naaman and Stokes, and it was a hard-fought battle, and you knew coming into it that they're, you know, big bodies, and they're going to be uh, trying to battle down low, and every time a shot goes up, that they're going to be crashing, and uh, we talked about that, and, you know, I'll take full responsibility of, you know, not being ready for that and not getting the other bigs ready, too. You know, it's something that we talk about, but... If I can't lead by example, if I can't do it myself, I can't expect other guys to just follow along too. And, you know, it's really disappointing how I played today. But, um, you know, knowing our team, we're going to bounce back tomorrow. And I can tell you that we're going to be really extremely fired up and that moving forward, we're going to use this as a lesson. We have a lot of young guys, and they're going to they're learn from that. Um, Yeah, you can see that he had that chip on his shoulder. But... Regardless of that, it was something that, you know, he just played harder than us and played harder than me personally. And, you know, that's why I said, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm grossly disgusted in how I played and, you know, how everyone played. Um, and I'll take full responsibility of that and we'll, you know, go forward and move on from this. To be honest, yes, but th that shouldn't be an excuse. There's no way you shouldn't get fired up, and especially being an older guy. You know, I've been to tournaments like this, and I've had to play back-to-back -back games, and that, that's where, I, you know, it's, it's, I keep using the word disappointing, but it's really disappointing that I couldn't rally the troops, couldn't, you know, get everyone going, and um, you know what? I, I don't want to look back too much on it, and, you know, we're just going to go forward from here and make sure that everything gets changed. Staying hydrated, you know, just moving on 
on to the next game, trying to focus on this one and drop the Iowa game with last night. Um, just wanted to rest our bodies. That was pretty much it. Just watch film and get prepared for this game. 